So, yeah. and, and the red flags are obviously, as you mentioned, you know, saturated market, something yep. way too common. Uh, yeah. If you look is, at the top 10, it should tell you everything. Or the top 20. Yeah. Should, if you look at the top 20, you should see everything you need to know. That's the top 20 products? The top 20 bestsellers on Amazon. Top 20 bestsellers. Go okay. to your niche and look at the top 20 bestsellers. Uh, I think this was in like a work gloves uh, niche. So I looked at the top 20. The, the reviews were in the high thousands. Which is, mm. which is a big flag. Oh, wow. So you look at the products. You look at, okay, how many people? Oh, yeah. Okay, Investors. that's how. That, that's a Mike Tyson. I don't want to fight him. <laughs> you don't want to fight him. Okay, so yeah. what's a good range of like reviews or purchases that you kind of, what's the sweet spot that you look for when looking at a niche? Um, I'd say that the, I'd say I don't want to be going over more than the 2,000. If the, no, if the, okay. if the, I mean, if there's one, if there's one that's dominant, I, I don't want to be in that niche. Mm. Um, but much of this isn't sold on my course. If anyone wants to check it out, but again, I don't really want to be competing in a niche that has more than uh, two thousand as the top. If that's the case, I'm probably going to struggle. 